keep scrolling, keep scrolling, keep scrolling if you do not care about the world believing in Jesus. A message from the Holy Spirit about the power of a group. We have de-evolved socially as a species. Where once individuals were sustained by the group, we have devolved to individuals trying to sustain themselves. Ancient people didn't have an overpowering government like we do, um, but they did face challenges like climate change, extreme changes in the weather. And survival was only attainable by staying within the group. For example, remains were found in the Turkana Basin of a group of people who survived by staying in one group despite the dangers of the ever-changing weather that they experienced. They knew they had to stick together in order to survive. Contrarily, in the body of Messiah, there are countless individuals who work for money so that they can survive on their own, personally. That's all for them. In addition to that, there are countless individual pastors who promote their individual ministries instead of working together for the survival of all believers. The spiritual climate in this realm, in this world, is terrible. If we want to survive, we need to work together as one group. The dangers of this world are very real and they're getting worse. Instead of individual advancement, individual ministerial advancement, we need to focus on group success in the body of Messiah. We need to evolve socially, learn how to work together to preserve God's kingdom on earth. Oneness and unity are a requirement. When the world sees our oneness and unity, they will finally, finally believe in Jesus. They will finally, finally believe in Jesus. John 17, 22 and 23. Here's a fun fact. There are 20 Christians for every one homeless person in America, according to statistics. On top of that, there are countless believers struggling and suffering to make ends meet because we refuse to work together. We let them fight on their own to receive employment to make enough money to survive no matter what their circumstances are. We look at them and say, it's your own fault. You can just go get a job. When you have that kind of mindset, it makes you look like you already took the mark of the beast uh, because you can't buy or sell without it. If other people want to survive, it's up to them to take the mark of the beast for themselves, just like I did. But the truth of the matter is, we need to get out of the system of the world now. As a group. As a people of Messiah. No one should have to fend for themselves in the kingdom of heaven. We can all work together. We can all work together to make sure that no one is in need. There is power in a group. Power to succeed. The power to advance. The power to survive. The power to make the world believe in God. And if you want to know how you can make a difference in this individualistic society, that goes against all oneness and unity, please message me right, message me, message me right away, right now. We cannot keep living every day, day to day, as if nothing horrifying is going on in the world, acting like we don't have the answer to these problems when we do. We have the answer. We have the answer to all of our problems. Please message me if you want to be a part of it. Thank you. Stay supernatural. Okay.